Good morning, Jim Berries. My name is Desiree and welcome to my channel. I don't know if it's morning, right? It's morning right now. It's like 6 11. I'm on my first cup of coffee. It says beach, please. I love aesthetic coffee cups. But anyway, this is going to be an unboxing video of some things that I ordered from ColourPop and Fourth Ray Beauty. Little backstory if you do not know, ColourPop is a basically it's not a drugstore brand but it's a drugstore price range brand they are online they are also in ulta's now as well as ulta online and they actually have a sister brand called fourth ray beauty and it's like their skincare line and so yeah i went a little ham crazy ordering um on there and so i just want to show you what i was able to get so Let's go ahead and without further ado, get in to the video, 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 video. Alrighty, so the first box we will unbox will be the ColourPop one, and I've already kind of opened it just to look at it. It looks like this right here. I think they do it so good with the box packaging. I mean, just look how cute that is. And in here, I ordered because they hit 7 million followers on Instagram, so their entire website was 20% off, which I loved. Love, so I picked up things that I'd wanted to be picking up through this right here. And then it also came with this really cute baggie right here. It looks like little slot machines on it. It says, are you feeling lucky? And it had a little scratch off in there um, where you could win 10% off, 20% or 15% off your total order on ColourPop. So this bag is just so cute, so cute, so cute. And then these are the products that I got in here. Let me just... Kind of hold it up. I don't want it to fall, so I'm gonna hold it up. Um, first product I'm gonna talk about. We'll start out with lips because that's the one I'm like pretty much excited about. I love a good red lippy. I love orange reds. I love cool tone reds. I love true reds. I love almost any red lipstick. Now they don't always all look good on me, but I love them on other people. I love red lipsticks. And ColourPop's lipsticks slay, y'all. They slay so 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 much. They're so cute. So it says is the ultra matte, ultra satin lip, ultra glossy lip. Okay, so I think this is a, I think this is a satin. I think this one's a satin. I don't. Mm, which is my favorite formula. What does it say? Yeah, this is the Ultra Satin Lip. I was reading like the packaging on the outside here. But this is the Ultra Satin Lip. This is the Kathleen Lights Collection. And this is Twinkling Lights. This is her one that she did for Christmas this year. This is in the color Lucky Star. And I finally broke down and bought this shredder because I had seen her wear it so many times on her channel and it looks stunning on her. So I was like, oh. And so I had been on ColourPop a few times, put it in my basket, and I was like, I don't know. I don't know if I need it or not because I have literally so many different lipsticks and I only wear them on certain occasions. So <laughs> I have so many lips, but I ended up getting this one. I have not tried it out yet, but I just think it is so gorgeous. It is stunning, absolutely stunning. And I love her Dream Lots collection that she has with ColourPop. Um, and I got the three lip kit off that one. And I love that one. Like I said, the satin lip is my favorite. Um, next to that one, the matte one isn't too bad. They're kind of softer mattes, but the ultra satin is amazing and it stays on and I love it. In addition to this, I'm not a lip liner person, but I'm trying to become a lip liner person. I want to become a lip liner person. So I got this one right here that is in the shade Frenchie. And this is just a red lip pencil to line or lip liner it looks so gorgeous can you guys see that right there look at that that is beautiful so i got that in the hopes that it is that it is going to match the um, kathleen lots really well so we'll see that is to be determined i'll do definitely some looks with these products right now i'm just kind of unboxing showing y'all what i got so the next thing i want to talk about is the becky g um highlighter this is in the shade chis did I get this eight? Which one did I get? It's called Luster Dust. These are the loose highlighters. This one's in Chisme. She's got one more in Princessa. Chisme has more of a goldy undertone, which is what I like. I do not like the pink undertone highlights. They don't look right on me. Um, they make me look very 
I don't know, like Santa Clausy. Like they make my highlight look very rosy, and I'm not a fan of that. So I had to go with the gold one, obviously. But let's just talk about the packaging here. Is stunning, Becky G. Like, look at that. That is so pretty. Oh, the teals, the colors. They just make me think of just like festival, springy time. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful packaging. Next are probably the three things I'm most excited about. And they are the loose pigments. They are the ones that Kathleen Lights did. Again, it's not a Kathleen Lights haul, I promise, but I love most of her products that she comes out with ColourPop. So I had to try these because they are so beautiful. And I've never really had anything like these in my collection. These are from her um, Zodiac collection. These are the pigments right here. I have three of them. I have the Scorpion, the Line, and the Scales right here. And if you want to watch her video, she actually goes into detail about all of these. And she actually swatches all of them. I'm not going to. I'm not a big swatcher person. I don't think it shows up the same as doing it on your eyelids. That's just my opinion. But I did get these three lovely ones right here. She has a total. I think there's a total of 12 of them. Um, there may be more, but I think there's a total of 12. Um, so, I actually got the Scorpion and the Scales because they're a little bit different than anything else I have in my collection because I'm not a pinky girl at all, but I actually wore the Scorpion and I absolutely loved it. It's like a burgundy pink and it's just stunning. The Scales is more of a pinkity pink and then the line is like the goldy one, but I'm actually a Leo, so that's why I had to get the line, but these are just so, so, so cute. And I'll actually open them up because I've opened up the Scorpion before. So I'll just kind of open it up for you and show you what they look like in the packaging. This packaging is so flippin' cute. And it's just, oh. And like if you go through this entire bottle, there is something going on here. Because there's so much stuff in here. And she actually uses hers as, um, I think she's one of like a nail polish. So that's really exciting. I get my nails gel because I can't paint. So I probably will not be using them as that. But I think it's so cool that you can multi-use these for different things other than just eyeshadow. So, along with those, I got the All Star Setting Spray. This is the Matte and Blur Face Setting Spray from ColourPop. The only reason I got this is because with those pigments, they say to use them on top of a glitter or to add a little bit of some type of setting spray to them whenever you're putting them on so they're wet and it really brings out the pigment a little bit more. So, I didn't have any glitter glue to put them on. But I did get the setting spray right here because I was like, well, I'm already on ColourPop and I need to make an order. So I'll just go ahead and grab their setting spray. And it works fantastic with those pigments. So I'm loving this. And this is the, and I really will only use this for those pigments because I use my Morphe setting spray for my entire face. And I'm not a matte girl. I like a little dewy luminous and just have it all setting there. So I will not be using this for my face, but I will be using this with my pigments. So... That is all from the color pop from from the color pop that I got. Next, we'll go show you guys what I got from Fourth Ray Beauty. And now their packaging came in this really pretty pink packaging here, and it says we can all use a little extra juju in our lives. Which, amen, y'all. <laughs> some good juju. It also came with a piece of paper right here that says I regret taking such good care of my skin. It said no one ever like that's so cute. It says sending good vibes your way on the back of it too. So this packaging again has 430 Beauty stamped on it. This is ColourPop sister brand. And it's affordable too. And that's what I'm all about. I'm all about affordability. If it can get the job done and it's affordable, go ahead and give it to me, girl. So this one is a little more sleeker packaging. It's not as not as like fun packaging. It's more sleeker. And I'm I'm okay with that, y'all. I'm definitely okay with that. So the products that I got were, I needed a new, I think it's your products at first. So I needed a new cleansing oil. I'm a big fan of whenever I go take off my makeup, the first thing I do is use an oil to break everything down. I'm a big believer in the Clinique Take the Day Off Cleansing Oil, but it's just a little bit more on the pricier side. So I was looking for more of an affordable option. So I ran across these at ColourPop. I think there were two for 20 two dollars if I'm right and I got a cleanser and I got a cleansing oil so both of these together I think were $22 the cleansing oil has 4.15 foot ounces in it and then the cleanser has 5.8 foot ounces in it so just opening these up like I said this packaging all about it 
the dogs are going crazy, you guys. It's literally not even seven in the morning and they're acting like freaking fools in there. <sighs> I'm telling you guys, it's crazy right here. But so this right here is the BFD Cleansing Oil and it says apply directly to dry skin, massage thoroughly over face, then add water to emulsify the product. Takes off makeup and debris. So this is, I needed a cleansing oil and this one was an affordable cleansing oil. Again, all sleek black packaging. I'm all about that, y'all. All about that. So we'll kind of throw that to the side there. Next one we have is the cleanser. It says the AM to PM gel cleanser. And after I try these products out for, oh, is that how that other one opened? I just, Yeah, I'm blonde. I just really ruined that freaking packaging. Uh, but look, it just opens like, how cute is that? It said, we are fourth rate beauty. We formulate effective skincare that delivers brag worthy. Tell all your friends. It's life changing results that are made simply with 100% cruelty free and vegan ingredients, y'all. No secrets, no surprises, no BS. You can trust us. Oh my gosh. This is so much cuter than what I thought it was. Like, I can't get over that package and I'm kind of mad that it's just all day, every day in the bottom of it right there. Oh, that's so cute. But this is the AM to PM gel cleanser. It says that you can use this wet face first, put two pumps in the wet hands, rub together, lather, massage on the face and neck, and rinse with warm water. So I think it's just a really good gel cleanser. I didn't smell either one. Let me do a smell test, y'all, because so. It kind of has almost like a cucumber under, under, a, cu a cucumber undertone, under scent. It, it smells kind of like some cucumbers up in there. So let me open up this one because now I'm mad that I didn't know that that's how that opened. Oh, ha, ha, ha. I just broke into the bottle. I'll smell the, the cleansing oil too just because I already have it out. I want to do a little smelly smell. So the... The oil doesn't really have a scent to it. The cleanser kind of has like almost like, it's a fresh scent, but it almost has like a cucumber undertone to it. So those are freaking amazing. Like how cute is that package? And I still can't get over that. Next, I just grabbed a few other things. I really love to put my hair up. I have blonde hair. So your girl doesn't really like to get anything in her hair, which any color hair, you don't want to get anything in there. But I got colored blonde hair and I don't want it to stain with any makeup. So I love using these little headbands right here. And this one was just too cute that I really could not like get over how cute this was. And I normally use a turby, tur, tur twist. Yeah, that's what I have over here on the side. It's kind of dirty, so I'm not gonna show y'all. But I normally use a tur twist to pull back my hair or cat ears or something like that whenever I wash my face. But this was just so cute. Like look how cute this is. It's just a little cat ear headband and it feels so soft, it's like velvet. And it doesn't have like a scent to it. Sometimes whenever you order things, they come like in plastic that are like velvet. They'll have a like fake scent to them. It doesn't have that, y'all. So really exciting. The next thing I'm pretty much excited about because I wanted one for a while and then I never bought it because I was like, I don't need it. I really don't need it. But then I was like, oh, if it, I guess I'll go ahead and get it. And it is the black opium. It's kind of like a jade roller. So this one's the black opium. So this one helps more with reducing, I think it's like redness or puffiness, but I just want to show you guys, it comes in the cutest little satin packaging right here. Uh, and it's, oh my goodness gracious, I just totally dropped that, but it's okay. We're gonna open it back up here. Oh, like look how gorgeous that is. And you just roll this onto the skin and it's, I can already feel it right now. It's so cool already. And it suggests that you can put it into the refrigerator, not the freezer though, because the freezer, it will break, but it's got the black opium crystal in it. And it just, it's the first time I've tried this out. So I'm like freaking amazed at it. And I've seen a lot of beauty gurus go to the Tatcha skincare. They get like Tatcha skincare done and they actually put the Tatcha mask on and they roll this over it. So it absorbs better in the skin. Now I'm gonna try to do that with any mask. So that would definitely be on a tryout coming up here very soon on my channel. So you guys, that's all I have for y'all today. That was the 4th Ray Beauty. That was the ColourPop. In the next coming up weeks, I'll try to try different things out for y'all. Let you know how the skincare goes. Because right now, I'm super excited that it's affordable skincare. And that it just, the packaging, y'all, 
get to 100 and i'm super excited for try out the rest of those pigments like i said i tried out the scorpion absolutely loved it i should try out scales and the line still i'm gonna try out that red lip y'all i'm just super excited about everything that i have got here today also a little side note and i want to mention it because it's kind of like coming up and about is afterpay um, that's how I got both of these products was through Afterpay. Afterpay is a four payment installment. You do not have to have a credit check for it. It's for interest payment installments. If you spend $35 or more, I know especially on ColourPop and 4th Ray Beauty, they have an entire online thing that you can go on. But if you need to restock your, any kind of makeup that, oh, excuse me, Lord. If you need to restock any kind of makeup that you're out of or skincare or anything like that, Afterpay is a great way to do it, especially if you don't have the money to spend on it right then, but you do need a full face of something. Great way to get it is through Afterpay, and it will actually take it out. So say I order this Friday whenever I get paid, and won't take it again for another two weeks whenever I get paid again. So that is super exciting, super fun. And so yeah, thank you, Jim Berries, for tuning in to my channel and I will see you guys next time. If you like this video, if you like me, hit that little subscribe button down below and come an honorary part of the Jim Berry Fan Bam. We would love to have you. It is a lit time here all the time, most of the time, depending on who you ask. And as always, bye Jim Berries. Mwah.